We're going to measure the freezing point depression of a solution of a compound in lauric acid. In order to measure the freezing point, we're going to calibrate a temperature probe. It will be a two-point calibration. We're going to place the temperature probe and a thermometer into a boiling water bath. We're going to wait a minute or two for the CBL reading to become stable. When the reading becomes stable, we're going to press trigger on the CBL and enter temperature from the thermometer. Okay. We're now going to put the temperature probe and the thermometer into an ice bath mixture. Again, we're going to wait till the reading on the CBL becomes stable. We're going to press trigger on the CBL and enter the temperature from the thermometer on the calculator. We've melted a sample of lauric acid in a test tube. We've put our temperature probe in the lauric acid. We're now going to start graphing the temperature versus time on our calculator. We're going to monitor the temperature as the compound solidifies to get the freezing point of the lauric acid. The temperature will drop and then level off as the compound solidifies. we can see crystals start to form. We've melted the lauric acid and we've dissolved our unknown in the lauric acid. We will now record the freezing point of the solution. We'll use the CBL again to monitor the temperature versus time to get the freezing point of the solution. This is the finished graph of the solution.